Frost Nova is so cool. She sings you a dedicated lullaby before she's about to kill you. And then, you know who else is cool? Or not cool, actually? Jessica. Look, I'm being so mean to Jessica. There's no reason for me to shit on Jessica. But last episode, I was re-watching my shit. I'm like, why am I making fun of Jessica so much? You know why? Because everyone else is using cool magic. Even the weapons are like RPGs. And you know what Jessica had? She got a fucking little pistol going pew pew. I'm like, come on. What are you going to do with the pistol, Jessica? It's not Jessica's fault. It's not Jessica's fault. It's, it's, it's the fucking the way that this character only has a fucking pistol for a weapon. And I hear you. I hear you. Apparently, she's a good character in the game later on. But I kind of feel bad for Jessica, so I apologize. Anyways, let's begin today's reaction. Chen. That's right. Lungman is falling. What you gonna do about it? I just realized Chen has a tail. Wait, 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 wait. wait. That's to you. Hey, 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 hey. Come, cover. Cover. Nah, she won't die. No, 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 no. Really? Chen? You good? It looks like she was about to get hit by like some kind of bomb, but why is she so wet? What the? F wait, why is she so wet? Huh? I didn't expect Chen fan service after she got hit by a bomb. <laughs> Swire. <laughs> Wait. She just threw a cup of water at her like, bitch, wake up! What? <laughs> it looked like she was carrying, she was worried so much about Chen there. Oh my god! Why is she so mean? Yeah, I thought she was really worried there and she was trying to save her. And then, as soon as she wakes up, she's like, bitch, wake the fuck up! Huh? You're off your nut. <laughs> This Swire? I don't know who Swire is, but I like her. I like her a lot. Lady... Lady S? That's like a nickname for her? Interesting. Okay, I like Swire and Chen's relationship. I, I didn't get that reference. What? <laughs> They're probably like really good friends, but they would never admit it. They love each other, but they hate each other. Love-hate relationship. Is she a tiger? What is that tail? I love how only one ear of Swire is shown and the other ear is like hidden by the hat. Great design. She took the hit, see? She took the hit for her, right? It was for you. See, see, so, see, see. Swire cares so much about Chen, but she just fucking... Wake the fuck up, bitch. Time is not on our side. Let's go. Ah. We gotta get to Longman first. I'm sure Doctor and Amiya will also go. Whoa, whoa! No, no, no! It's not like that. But damn, what a that! You could definitely think that way. Damn, this guy's got balls. I can't believe he actually said. That. I can't believe he actually said that to them. Holy shit! Okay. Based NPC. I don't know his name, but damn. I think I'll save Amiya then, bitch. <laughs> bye bye. Way. Dragon dude. What's Way up to? And I kept saying that I had a feeling in season one that Way would somehow like betray Longman. Or somehow he's make a backdoor deal. I don't know. I'd have to look at season one again to re remember why I said that. He did. Damn, this is like a dying message. Huh? Their trap. Who's they? Which one? Which of the reunion? This is where you say, I'll kill you if you die. I will kill you if you die. That's an order. I don't. Tell me about it. Oh. That's actually super important. Because I told you, I have responsibilities. Sh Yo, everything around Chen is kind of breaking. These relationships. Maybe he was right about how the he, how we treated the infected wrong. Uh, this is kind of tense. Probably to protect her, she didn't tell her. Oh, this is really tense. Are you sure? I thought this is a trap. I mean... Okay? But I thought this is a trap. Who else is in here? Oh shit. Three minutes! Boom! Boom! <laughs> I love using shield as a weapon. You just bash them in. That was three seconds! That was it? The three people? <laughs> I thought there would be some kind of trap. Like, I don't know. Some important reunion member was in here baiting us. There's Fal. You there? You there, buddy? <gasps> He's still up! His eyes. Yo, did he get his eyes gouged out? 
More of pain nights. Imagine Chen forgets this sequence. Palula. One of their commanders. Which commander? This guy's like a brother to her, right? Bro. I don't even know who Fal is, but somehow this show is able to get me emotionally invested into a character dying like this. Usually I don't give a shit about any characters in random anime that just die for no reason, but like... Damn. You think he'll live? It's because they set the precedent that he's like a little brother to like Hushikuma, right? It's that. That's what's weighing on me right now. Old place. What old place? Oh my god. And as soon as fingers give out, he's dead, right? As soon as his fingers go limp, it's dead, right? Wow. Like, like I said, usually in animes, they do a lot of people dying off to make some kind of emotional impact, but they don't know how to handle it well. This was done well because they set the precedent that there was like a brother-sister-sibling relationship. More stuff along the lines of Chen and Hoshiguma getting tense because she wouldn't tell her because he got infected. And then even on top of that, at the end, that hideout. One last thing to kind of like... Uh, like, like a memory between them. Oh, she's a rich girl. You could have just climbed, but okay, break the doors. <laughs> yeah, just busted your own gates. Fuck it, just destroy the doors. Oh, daddy issues. <laughs> just bust the doors. The Chen's house is fucking... Man, they lived a good life. <laughs> Well, I'm sure it wasn't a good life because, as you said, a man like him is no father. Damn, look at the size of that bed. Holy shit, bro. <laughs> so bougie. Family picture? Talula? Wait, 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 wait. Chen and Talula were childhood fr Am I Am I reading that right? That was Talula, right? There's too many silver-haired girls in this show, but I swear to God, that was Talula with their horns going out that way. Only past memories. Oh, I thought she'd say that. What? Oh, that's why she didn't tell her. That he's still stick around. See, there's reasons. Chen isn't this evil person. Let's go. Let's go into battle. Come on. Come on. Which reunion leader is here? Oh. A girl reunion mob. What, what is this? Shen? Oh shit, Shen! Yeet! Should have bashed him with the shield. Bonk him! Oh. Oh! Maybe I want that treatment from her. Who is she? <laughs> she changed her. She changed her voice somewhere. It's there. Piano's already damaged. It's it's over. It's I'm sorry. It's done. Bye bye. Yo, Chen has these amazing one-liners. It's all situational. Hey, you done with that? Boom, done. The piano? Oh, yeah, sure. I want... Yeah, this is too easy. Don't jinx it, though. Exactly. That's what I'm waiting for. Because so far, we've only fought these random fodder. I want an actual, you know, a waifu to show up. An actual character with design and not wearing the masks. Oh? The fuck is that? Just new outfits? Oh, the mighty Chen probably has no time to think about fashion. Would be weird to see Chen wear like a dress. Some casual clothes. Anytime you have sentimental moments like this, I don't know. Usually they're setting some kind of downtime to remember the good times. And then it softens you up. And then, it's, and then after that, it's like murder, death, despair. Don't say some shit like, maybe after this, we can go one day. Because that's like a death flag. Oh, who's that? Some dude with the mask. It's that girl again. Who is this girl? Because all our reunion members so far has been guys underneath the mask. Bomb, 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 bomb. 
suicide attack? I don't think Shen would just die like this, but... Underneath, who's down here? Damn, Chen got hit by a fucking bomb thing today. And now... Oh, Hoshigama, hold it up! <laughs> at least she didn't throw water at Look at that! Look at that rubble rock thing! Holy shit! Okay. You just get out of the way. Just, just move first. Just move first. Okay. Go! Okay. She is so strong. Okay. Made it out safe, I think. Yeah, you are really strong. Damn. But who's going to save her ass? No, stop that. Stop that. The moment you start talking about this emotional shit, I, I just feel like death flags are coming. It's like, oh, we could have been good friends in a different life. Like some shit like that. Don't do it to me. But these are random masked fodder. It's fine. Shen can do this. No, I don't know about that. You are my responsibility. Chen, character development. I love how they're all just giving Chen a chance to do this epic monologue. And now I will protect you. Oh shit! <laughs> I like these two. And episode ends. Oh, never mind. It's not over yet. Oh, we got out safe. Nice. I thought they were going to actually show us the fight, but Chen just like, Aah! boom, done. There, there's nothing Yuri going on here, but I, I like these two. They're great. Shire, what was that? The blonde tiger girl in the beginning? She was very feisty, but Hoshiguma and Chen, I think that's better. Princess? Who is this? Huh? Yeah, you're totally a rich girl, but who is this? Is this Shire? Or that girl, the tiger girl in the beginning? <laughs> They're still reminiscing about the old past. Oh, shit. I don't like it when you start thinking about the good old days during, you know, scenes like this. Because this shit is like death flags, man. <laughs> She's still fucking someone up while talking. Just realize she has a fang too. Lady S. They both call each other like lady and then she calls her like princess. Hmm? Your life is precious. Don't die on me. Is this setting something up for the future? Because why are they going so hard in this episode to develop these, these characters, these trios, talking about the past? I, I just have a really bad feeling for the future. Who, who is this? What the fuck? Oh, Chen. Damn! Now this is where the real enemies are at, right? Next episode though. And that's it. Conceal. What a beautiful episode. I mean, did Fal die there? I think he kind of did. But, but, but if we ignore the death of Fal and he, even that, there's moments in this episode where they just go so much into the LGD trio. The Tiger Girl, Hoshikuma and Chen. And they're just talking about the past. And they're just getting us feel more emotionally invested into these characters. And... You know what I think is going to happen? I don't think we're going to recapture the LGD building. I think next episode is going to be complete despair. I think they're setting us up. They're buttering us up, making us so emotionally invested in these characters. So that next episode, when shit goes down, it's going to be a fucking dagger to the heart. And I'm going to feel it even more. But you know what? We're watching Pain Nights for that anyways. But hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.